Well, when we wrap things up last week, in addition to you giggling all the time, you mm -hmm. also mentioned possible storms today. So I did. Is, is that still the case? Uh, giggling or the storms? <laughs> You're already starting to giggle, so I'm check to for the first one. <laughs> uh, but we do have rain on the way. Now, okay. we haven't seen any yet. Not okay. much sunshine today. It's a little dreary out there. It but is. Some of our viewers in Hillsdale are probably catching a few raindrops right now. All right. Yeah, let's have a look at that radar. It's going to be a busy night later on. There's not a lot going on right now. You see it nearby, 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 and a lot of it's been kind of fading out before reaching us. But a few of us in our far southern edge of mid-Michigan are seeing the rains. They're getting a little bit more steady. See some of the yellow for heavier precipitation. It's moving right into Hillsdale as we speak from the south and southwest. But it's pretty much just rain. A few rumbles of thunder are on the Ohio side of the border. It's nearby. This evening will be a little scattered. We'll see more of this creep in throughout the night. Temperatures 78 right now in Lansing, 77 Jackson. A little bit cooler down towards Hillsdale with the recent rainfall. But 70s today, a couple of us did reach 80 briefly earlier on. Dew point moderate, low 60s. It's a little on the humid side, but not as bad as it has been in some recent days like last week. Zooming out, there's your system. That's bringing in a lot of trouble. There's your center. Got a nice organized rotation to it. You know, scattered rain across a lot of the Great Lakes and Midwest. This is your warm front creeping into mid-Michigan right now. And then you do see the cold front extending down through Illinois. So there's a lot going on with this system. Multiple rounds of rain are expected. As we go through weather headlines here, Rain and storms tonight, and they continue through Tuesday. Tomorrow, mainly the daytime tomorrow, and then it should start to dry up by Tuesday evening. And along with it, a little bit cooler midweek. We'll see a little bit lower in the dew point, a little bit lower in the temperatures, 70s for highs for a few more days yet. But in your future track tonight, cloud cover sticks around. We'll see just a few scattered showers possible this evening. Like I said, there's some already nearby, but it's not going to be widespread. They're trying to creep in from the south. It's just taking its time. Overnight tonight, late after midnight, certainly more likely to catch the catch these scattered thunderstorms, maybe even some brief heavy rains, and that could be the story for Tuesday morning. So your morning commute might have some trouble early tomorrow into lunchtime. It should slowly start to taper off. This is tonight through the daytime tomorrow, which, which is the heaviest rain window. By Tuesday afternoon, still going to catch a few scattered showers and storms, but by your evening uh, commute here, I think things will start to slowly kind of calm down, break apart, and then very little rain is expected by Tuesday evening. Tuesday night, the clouds might linger, but those two will be fading away. Wednesday's forecast, some partial sunshine. Uh, further down into the future track here Wednesday night through Thursday, likely to stay dry, a little cooler, a little less humid, some sunshine. Here's Thursday afternoon. We'll catch a break from rain later this week. Mid and upper 60s tonight, rain and storms are expected, some heavy rain possible overnight. But if you're going out this evening, just keep your eye on the radar. It might be a little scattered and spotty. Tomorrow, mid and upper 70s, rain and storms likely, particularly in the morning, it will be breaking apart and drying up by later in the day and into the evening. Into the seven day 70s for a while, 50s at night, cool list I believe on Wednesday, but that might vary a bit on some cloud cover. Thursday's forecast, more sunshine. Friday, Friday night through Saturday, a few showers and storms are looking likely there too. It's not a total washout this weekend just yet. Just a chance for a next Sunday and it does get warmer. Mid and upper 80s do return, but a little cooler this week. It's been a while since we've had a high of 75. It'll be a little refreshing I think so. <laughs> before the rain comes back. Yeah. All right, Dustin, thank you.